Hey everyone, and welcome back. Uh, today we're going to be doing our first Team Star base, which is going to be the Dark Type base. And it is right next to uh, the Water Gem town. And the levels, I think, are like, like uh, 2021, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, 2021. So, for our team, we have... Uh, Fletchender I'm going to have up there because he's going to have a Ponyard for his first Pokemon. And then I have Flamigo and Nimble here for uh, the River Room. So we should be all ready for this. Now let's go up here to the gate, I guess. Oh, we're going to be beat these guys first. Oh, well. This video will be a little bit longer than the last one. The last one was very short. <laughs> whoa, whoa, hold it. Up ahead's uh, Team Star Dark Crew. Don't take kindly to kids like you. Are you that wise dragon kid? Yeah, yeah. Talk about suspicious. Mm. Buzz off or get thrashed by me bat in battle, kid. Whew. Yeah, I'll take you on. It's fine. Let's just beat them up and get on with this. Good job, Fletchender. But you are level 25, so I'd expect this from you. Uh, did she only have one Pokemon or two? Yes, learn Bite. I love Bite. Uh, we don't need to get Quick Attack, it's fine. Yeah. Uh, hopefully we don't have to defeat the other grunt. I mean, it won't be that big a deal if we do, but... It's just annoying. How the heck could I lose? Oh. Hasta la vista. She's new to the team. <laughs> Oh my. I'm going to go into the base now and give the rest of the squad the heads up. We'll come at you full force, set foot inside, so want to consider turning tail. Either way, best of luck to you, amigo. Well, he's nice. Hasta la vista. <laughs> Cassopia, wonderful. See you took care of the guards. Nice work. Now hold up in the base is Team Stars, Dark Crew, the Seguin Squad. Giacomo? Giacomo? Runs the base. That wild soundtrack of theirs is himself. Oh. Sharp guy. Uh, won't ruffle him. Okay. Just keep defeating Pokemon until the big man himself shows up. Okay. I think I got it. Um, boop, boop, boop. Ding a ling a ling. I think it would have been cool if Team Star, uh, each one of their bases was based on, like, either an action movie or, like, a certain actor. Like, <laughs> that would have been wonderful. Oh, Clive. How are you doing, Clive? Careful now, Wise Dragon. Team Star is a unique way of doing battle. Called the Star Brigade. Uh, so yeah, I have to do the Let's Go feature. Maybe if I want to get low, come back here and I'll heal him for you. 
Okay. Heads up, gang. Some jump up... Some jumped up kid has watered in. Okay. Let's teach him a lesson. Defeat 30 Pokemon in 10 minutes. Okay. Shouldn't be bad. I don't think I've ever had to, on my other game, uh, get healed up. So, we should be fine. Oh, Nimble, you poor boy. You're already hurt. So maybe we are not that great. Oh, Zora! Oh. One of these is shiny. On my other playthrough, I actually did do a shiny hunt uh, for uh, Zora, and I got it. Which I posted on Twitter, if you guys haven't got it on there yet. Come on, Nimble. Defeat your own kind. Okay, we're at 16. And Nimble's gonna be the next one out, out pretty soon. Uh, 20. Okay. Okay, Nimble's out. We can finish this without him, though. That's no big deal. Oh, Sneasel. Okay, here's some more. But yeah, you should not need the whole uh, 10 minutes for this. It's pretty easy. Okay, here's the two skunk tanks real quick. Or skunkies. Why'd you go over there, bud? Make a flamingo do all the work? I'm appalled. Hey, the boss is here now. Now, I will say, these big rev of rooms or whatever, they're kind of hard if you're not ready for them. Oh, he does have a nice soundtrack. You've done a real number on us, Party Crashers, Wise Dragon, was it? I'm uh, Giacomo. At the deck, uh, I go by DJ Vice. <laughs> Call me whatever. It's a vibe either way. Nice to meet you and all. But how about we skip uh, straight to our, your outro? No. Don't worry. I'll pick you a sick Requiem as you crash and burn. Well, thank you, I guess. Let's get this party started. Eh. It is a nice song. I, I do like it. Come on. Come on, DJ Vice. Oh, Ponder, you're going to get wrecked by this. Whoosh. Oh, I, I was hoping for a one hit. Oh well. Aerial Ace on my Fletchender, really? There we go. Now for the real uh, battle, I guess. The River Room. Time to up the tempo. Level 20 Sanguine Star Mobile. Let's see if we can get our uh, speed up a little bit. But it might not matter because we're probably going to die. At least Fletchinder is. But I've got a real... Uh, Ooh, ooh. 
I've got a real winner in there. Flamigo's gonna win. I believe in him. How am I not faster yet? Jeez. That I'd hope it would get burned. There we go. I'm sorry, Flexender. You're a worthy sacrifice. Time to bring out the big guns. Let's see how much this does. <laughs> Flamigo, my big boy. Come on. You know, I kind of feel like I probably should give Flamigo a name. But then again, I like Flamigo. I like the name Flamigo. Come on, come on, come on. Woo wee. Yeah, Flamigo, you're, you're doing fine. One more attack. There we go. I could not recommend Flamigo enough. If I'd have had him on my first playthrough, oh, chef's kiss. Whoa. Didn't expect that, did you, huh? <laughs> Guess that's that. Oh. Oh, what, what's happened? Oh, flashback. About a year and a half ago. Guess that's that. What's up, Giacomo? Did something happen? The big boss just wanted to take on some stuff. So we had a chat and settled a few plans. A few plans, like for what? Operation Star, first of all. A new code of conduct for the team. You know, tons of new members have joined recently. Gotta figure out some rules, like code. Nice of you to come up for a great code for us, won't you, Gikomo? Yeah, you'll come up with a good code. Ha, no thanks, way too much pressure. I used the president of the student council, but you know everyone ended up hating me after that. Yep. Uh, you forced a ton of stuffy rules on everyone. Uh, they w wouldn't take it. Kind of help but concur. Male students' hair must stray no further from 1.8 inches below the nape and so forth. Aww. Your rules were vexation, vexation made manifestation? Okay. My point exactly, so you'll all agree that I shouldn't be let anywhere near this new code. But you always know what's best for the team, Yakomo. You look out for us. You've earned our trust so many times over. Without you, Team Star wouldn't work. Stuck up student council prez isn't who you are. Are any more man? Aww. They're just good friends. They're not bad guys. Okay, thanks for the ego boost, everyone. I'll do it. I'll write the damn code. Aww. Did the best I could. My days of boss are over. Take my star badge. Aww. I feel bad for beating him now. I feel like I'm kind of bullying them. They're just like living out their lives here, and I just came around and I'm like, I'm going to beat you up. Take over the team. Uh, foul play? Okay, nice. So this is how the party ends. Let's talk about those Pokemon yours. They're crazy strong. Oh, thank you. You know those, learned those uh, trainer chops at the academy? Sure did. 
Yeah, I'm enjoying the academy, I guess. Even though I haven't really been at the academy much. Sorry to interrupt, but are you, uh, Giacomo? Uh, wasn't expecting a giant pompadour <laughs> to make a guest appearance today. You get a quacksley to style that keep you up? Yeah, yeah. Just a quick word, would you mind? Uh, seems all of you and Team Star are headed for expulsion if you get, keep up activities. Uh, so why don't you break up the team and start attending class? A pal, a close friend of yours, is coming back? They're only the strongest boss in all of Team Star. Like how there's a top champion who's absolutely number one trainer? Ah, so there's a big boss over Team Star. Okay. Yeah, where's your big boss? Would you like to know, Wither Boy? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Uh, left in a year and a half ago, okay. Maybe the big boss did ditch us. No, come on. <laughs> Is the sky blue? Yeah. Let me put you words, eggheads, uh, academy, I understand. They're my greatest treasure. Aww! Aww! He's a sweet guy. Come on. I feel bad for them. At least they found uh, people to, like, I guess work and hang out with uh, here and stuff. Rudder, -ru rudder. Wise Dragon, it's me. Seems Giacomo no longer carries his star badge. He gave it to you, did he? So am I the leader now? I see. With a spot out of the picture, uh, Segwa and Scott will break up. Yep. Oh, Giacomo. Sorry, got caught up in thought. Ooh, some LP as a reward. 5,000, that's not bad, I guess. Ooh, more kinds of TMs. Okay. Someone from the supply unit will be here to give you materials to make TMs. Nice! Penny? Hello there. I'm Penny from the supply unit. You're such cute. I love your Eevee backpack. You look so comfy in your hoodie. Yeah, I was glad to help. Oh, so you do remember... I'm helping out Operation Starfall. Part of an independent study, you know. Good with machines and hacking and stuff, so I'll be working behind the scenes. Okay, nice to be working with you, Penny. Here's your bonus reward from Cassiopeia. Uh, Cassiopeia said you'll get more rewards each time you take out a star base. Okay. Four more squads left. Okay. Bye, Penny. That Eevee backpack is adorable. I wish I could get one of those. Or, I mean, I wish I could just change my clothes. I mean, these... You can't really ch do much customization on here compared to Sword and Shield. But, yeah. So, that is the first team star base. The dark team base. Uh, Captain Giacomo. Hope I'm saying his name right. And, yeah. So, thanks for watching, guys. And next one, we'll go on with our thing. I don't really know what's next, but I'll have to see. <laughs> so, thanks for watching, guys. And, bye!